Gio. I'm Bart. I'm Shannon. I'm Joe, and you're watching Ask, Ask the Feels. And today we have a question from Dominic. I've been dating this girl for four months now, and I still love her a lot. We have sex and everything, but my friends are getting mad that I'm spending a little bit too much time with her and not enough time with them. What should I do? Oh man, you're so popular. <laughs> you're so cool, man. Oh damn. You're so cool. Everybody wants to be with you. I mean, this. I think everyone, every every guy goes through this. That's why girl. they came up with. Oh really? Yeah. Especially in the the high school period too. Yeah. I feel like. Cause I feel like all your friends are singles, they're all losers. Mm -hmm. And then if you're the one with the girlfriend, they're like, oh, you ain't down with the homies anymore? It's like, it's cause, well, you guys don't have girlfriends, you guys are just chilling all the time. I don't know, for me, I always wanted to just like, make my world about this guy, and I just wanted to be with this guy. This is high school me, by the way. And I, and I, I just wanted to just be with him, and I, I would like, push all my other friends away, and they'd be like, what the fuck, You push them away on purpose? No, I'd be like, <laughs> you're just like, like I need you anymore. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean they would want to hang out and I would make all these excuses as to why I couldn't hang out with them anymore So then I'd be like, you know, I can't my mom will let me go or I have to do whatever And then they would find out that I was like hanging out with my boyfriend. Dang, liar. I know I was such a dick. I That's fucked up. It's cool though I mean you just do what's authentic to you when you have a new mm -hmm. relationship You're just gonna want to spend more time with that person in the beginning that fades, right? Yeah, true You know what I mean? Yeah, because oh, now now like during our anniversaries, we're inviting all of our friends with us because we're like, it's just more fun when there's more people. Whereas before, it's probably like, oh, anniversary, oh, we just got, it's gotta be all special and shit. But then now I'm like, bored of that shit, so we're like, let's bring more people. But you see it differently, right? From what? Like a relationship. Like you, I, I know you like, you know, adding more people to your pack. Yeah, I, I think it's awesome when, you know, the couple can also like come along with the group and still add on to the group meaning like it doesn't have to be either you know the couple all the time or the group of friends maybe um, as they mature they need to have like girlfriends just it needs to be a co-ed group <laughs> in high school a lot of guys just stick with like their three four guy friends and then that's all they do is just either play games all day or go play basketball or whatever they don't go out and meet girls or add girls to the group of friends and I think that's socially fucked up so they have the problem, not you. Mm -hmm. He's cool. It's the rest of y'all <clears throat> fuckers. What? Well, but <laughs> well, it might. But it. But it also might be like Geo, where like he's spending so much time that it's almost as if he just completely forgot about that they're they're even friends, and that's kind of fucked up too. Yeah. He needs to so balance it out. Cause your friends can't suck you the way she does. Oh my god. Do you think do you think as a homie then that he should be like, hey, you know what, homies, like I, I found this girl, I really like her a lot. You know, we're spending a lot of time together. I wanna get to know her, so is it okay if I just kinda remove myself from the group or is that like is he already putting too himself? Is that yeah, too yeah. How hard is it to balance friendship and a girlfriend though? I think a lot of people once they get too immersed in something, they kind of have tunnel vision. They don't even see what their consequences are. Cause I, I don't think I've ever had that problem, but I did. I do remember feeling that way with certain friends, cause they would just completely disappear, not contact you or at anything. And then after four or five months later, they come back and want to be a part of the group because they're not in a relationship anymore. Yeah. And then when when people do that, I feel I feel like the group feels used, yeah. as if like oh, so we're like part time friends. And then when you don't, when there's other interesting people around you just leave us like that and I think there his group of friends might be feeling that you know yeah that's very possible too. <clears throat> yeah I think you have that honeymoon phase in the beginning yeah. where it's like everything's so new and you want to keep exploring and like finding out more about each other and it's just so fun and like everyone else is just not on the same level or the same page as you so you're like you're like I just want to be with this person and just like love them forever and I think that's how like people just have that tunnel vision that you're talking about I think like Shannon said if you destroying and, and you terminate that thing that you and your homies have going on, I think that's when it becomes like detrimental to the relationship. Like let's say you have a gym buddy and you always go like Monday, Wednesday, Fridays with them and then all of a sudden you don't even go to the gym anymore and you're completely changing your entire lifestyle to fit the girlfriend and instead of having the girlfriend assimilate into your current lifestyle and actually making it better, I think that's when it's detrimental and then you probably gotta reevaluate what's going on. Thank you for watching Ask the Feels. Let us know what you think of this episode in the comments below. And for the last video, go over here. Imagine you wanting to come, but then you're just holding it for fucking 20, 25 minutes, just pumping away. It's yeah. God damn, it's, it gets frustrating. Yeah, it's like having really? a, a, a delicious apple pie, and you just Licking it and it just every time you lick you're like god damn this tastes so good but you suck <laughs> the whole thing but you just gotta I'm not just another lick I just another lick
it's 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 like so torture. Really? Is it like yeah. holding in your pee? Is that how it feels? Like not I'm not talking about the whole pleasure part, but the actual like holding in